here we connected the 10 ohm load resistor the normal temperature is a 29 because of that room temperature now i am going to show the things peak value before it's printing here 000, when we started to work on this project, it will show here 0 0.5. This is the current rating of 10 ohm load resistor. Welcome to Pantech Solution. Today we are going to see about transformer monitoring system using with ESP8266 microcontroller. In this project, we are using transformer, current sensor, slide switch and load resistor, bridge rectifier, capacitor, variable resistor, disk capacitor, 5 volt Zener diode and the MCP3008 ADC converter and microcontroller. Let's we see how it is working now. I connected the transformer to the 230 power supply and uh, we are going to measure the current rating and voltage and temperature of this transformer. Here we are connected to the Wi-Fi network. Here we connected the 10 ohm load resistor. For that load resistor, current rating is 0.5 and voltage is 5 because of here we connected the transformer 232 9 volt step down transformer. The, the step down transformer is con converted to 5 volt here. That's why we are printing here 5 volt. The normal temperature is a 29 because of that room temperature. Now I am going to show the things peak value before it's printing here 000 when we started to work on this project it will show here 0 0.5 this is the current rating of 10 ohm load resistor now we connected the 1 ohm load resistor to the transformer why because we have to measure the temperature in the transformer when we connected the 1 ohm load resistor to the transformer the transformer is getting the heat here it will show the 42 temperature now and voltage is 0 because of we made the short connections and current rating is 1.43 and that values are shown in things peak also here it is showing the 1.49 1.5 the current rating and voltage is 0 and temperature is 41 this is the working procedure of transformer monitoring system. Thanks for watching this video. To more about this project, please check the description box.